Welcome back to Novacast, everybody. This is Rob playing some more of Tears of the Kingdom. Alright, and we are going to continue upgrading our pooper pad. Let me see what the trauma medallion. To be able to travel instantly to your favorite uh, place, use the travel medallion feature while standing on that post. <coughs> Look in your key items to see how many travel gates you can establish. You currently have the ability to make one. I'd like to increase it to two, but for that you need around 10 map data locations. You get you get map data registered on the Pearl pad at each Skyview Tower. So just zoom around and or to more of those. <laughs> That kind of thing should be a walk in the park for someone like you. Want to hear anything else about my inventions before you rush off? But I already have... Okay. So do I need to add new places or what? Well, we'll deal with that one later. Let's let's look at uh, Hero's Path Mode. <laughs> Hero's Path Mode is an astounding addition to uh, addition if you do a lot of investigating. Truth is, there's a tracking feature installed in the Pro Pad. Hero's Path Mode. Let's you see this feature on screen. It's a brilliant system that lets you see the exact path you've taken. Whoa. But before I can install the prototype perfectly, I need you to get data from 15 shrine locations uh, from you. Whoa. What? You've got the data. Uh, hurry up and let me see that fur bed. Alright, now give me just a moment. Alright, ta-da. Now you'll be able to see the path you've traveled so far on your map. Oh yes, I should prepare operation instructions for this feature too. Hang on a moment. Alright, awesome. The Pearl Pad is not yet perfect. It still doesn't have all of the available features. So, don't forget that. <laughs> so, which feature do you want to add? <laughs> Excellent. Very good thinking, being curious about this feature. It allows you to pinpoint the location of more, more than shrines. Any more thing, or many more things. That's why it's called Sensor Plus. You select what you want from the uh, compendium, but I can't add my prototype without some extra data. So you need to fill out your compendium with at least five types of monsters. It's hard to get data on monsters without putting yourself at risk. You'll need to be careful. Uh, you'll need a careful approach, or a quiet one. Though, you could grab their attention any way you want and snap a picture on the fly. Then, you'll have, have your data. 
Do you want to hear anything? Oh, okay. That's kind of cool that they do that. Okay. All right, so let's keep doing what we were doing. All right, so let's start making our way towards Hateno. Yeah, I know, there's a shrine. All right, let's do this. S uh, scoop it out. Okay.
waiting for it. There we go. And uh, collect another expansion to my life. Let's, uh, not heart container, but the stamina vessel. with all the mushrooms. Okay. Someday, a second store. Ah. Welcome to Kochi Dye Shop. Right, so you're a new customer, I think. Well, I don't do the dying around here. You want my hubby for that. All this activity is getting to be a problem. I mean, I'm grateful to Cece that our shop has taken off like this, but every day is so exhausting now. <laughs> oh, look at that. If you're looking for, um, if, if you're looking to add some color to your wardrobe, you found the right place. Hugh, uh, do you do? Welcome to the Kochi Dye Shop, where we live to die. If you have any dye ingredients, it's 20 rupees. To dye an item, that includes our service charge, of course. Let's get going with dying. And and you're good up too. Huh? 
Oh, what a lovely paraglider you've got there. Nowadays, not only do we dye clothes, but we also offer a fabric uh, rework uh, service. Bring me some fabric and I can rework your paraglider with flying colors. <laughs> you may be a first time customer, but that's fine. We have a special introduction to our new service for folks like you. Ta-da! Your very own introductory fabric. Nice. <laughs> have you dropped by Ventus Clothing at the village entrance yet? Cece, the famous designer who runs the place now, cooked up the cutting edge design for this fabric. Every region has its own unique fabric design. Keep an eye open for them whenever you go, or wherever you go. Think of me if you find some new fabrics, won't you? We can rework your paraglider if are with it for you to fly the skies and, and stop. <laughs> Dying clothes to the color of your choice or reworking paragliders with some new cloth. Either way, it'll take just 20 rupees. Uh, let's rework my paraglider. This your first time reworking a paraglider, is it? Don't worry. I'll do all the work. You just hand over the fabric and leave the rest to me. Okay, so we got the original. We got the Hudson construction fabric. We got the Lucky Clover Gazette fa uh, uh, fabric, the Horse God fabric, the CC fabric, Tunic of Memories fabric, Champions Leather fabric, the Pixel fabric, the Coblin fabric, Lolan Ranch fabric, the Majora's Mask fabric. The Sword Spirit Fabric. Hylian Hood Fabric. The Egg fab uh, Fabric. Hylian Princess Fabric. The Begone Royal. Goddess. Sheik. Zora Champion. Goron Champion. Rito Champion. Gerudo Champion. Ancient Sheikah Mirror of the Twilight King of Red Re King of Red Lions Princess of Twilight Demon King And that's it. Alright, let's see. I think I'm gonna go with If you're fine with that one, then slip me 20 rupees and we'll get started. Hey. Thanks for the business. This won't take a moment. No watch, uh, no watching paint dry for you. Sure. Set in fabric, ready to launch. That'll do her. Looking forward to your next visit. <laughs> now go out and paint the town red. Alright, let's go over here. Oh. Miss Zelda still isn't back. Is it because she's disappointed in me? Ah. Oh, oh. Do you have business with or at Miss Zelda's house? You know she's not back home yet, right? Mm. Right around the time of the upheaval, Miss Zelda had uh, just stopped coming home. 
She's always used to say, see you later, whenever she left the village, but not that time. Okay. So our house, our old house, has become Zelda's house. Okay. Look at the wrong thing. Okay. All right, sell this journal. After the calamity, I asked myself how to rebuild and set out across Hyrule in search for an answer. I saw collapsed buildings, lost cities, the damage was far worse than I had imagined. But as I watched the people and heard their stories, I was convinced all was not lost. The people's spirit, or spirits were not broken, and their strong wills of Hyrule's greatest treasure. They are the ones who will rebuild and my contribution to their efforts will be to protect them while they can do this or do so. As part of Hyrule's reconstruction, we've built a school in a Taino village. It's the largest Hylian village with its sprawling, bountiful land. There are so many children living here that it seemed the ideal place to find a school. I've recruited Simon from the Research Institute to teach them, or teach there. He was Pro's assistant for years, which makes him well equipped to deal with the needs of quirky children. Um, I'll be overseeing the school for a while myself to keep an eye on the students. I commissioned Volson, who taught his trade at or to Hudson Construction, who taught his trade to Hudson of Hudson Construction to construct the school for this. He seemed deeply moved by the request. This will be his final job in the Taino village before he sets off on a journey. I had him add a secret room to my house. One that won't appear on the plans. It's dim but uh, it's dim but humidity and temperature temperature controlled. So it's very comfortable. It's proven very useful when I'm working alone and need to concentrate. Work on the school has been moving along smoothly, but a major problem recently reared its head. We don't have enough teachers. Simon is interviewing people, but he hasn't found a good fit yet. I'd like to hire someone intelligent, educated, and capable of learning or earning the children's trust. Nurturing our children is an extensive is an extension of our duty to this land. We shape our future by the way we shape their path. I hope to see sterling members of our community come to this village and take up that mantle as their teacher. Okay. All right, let's try to find this room.
Well. Well-worn hairband. An old, worn, simple hairband. Its color has long faded, but it still has have some life left in it. Wearing it in your hair makes you sen sentimental about times past. Okay. Though the calamity is over, its scars remain. A mountain of problems strand or stands before us even as we begin to rebuild. No matter where I go to offer aid, Link remains at my side. A kindness that has taken a visible toll on his clothing. That's why I've put an order in for a new an improved champion's tunic just for him I just can't wait to see the look on his face when I surprise him with it I'll hide it in the throne room so he won't find it until after our investigation even he would never s expect that the torches are the key which I already got it completed. Yep. Okay, let's head this way. They're all wearing mushrooms now. Sorry for the long and sorry for the song and dance, but I got a business to run. Anywho, you're saying something about uh, what I can do for you? Oh, all right. Ah, oh.
All right, there we go. Hmm. Hold right there. You can't cut in line. We're here first. Oh. As I said multiple times now, I can't admit three customers at present. What do we do? We took the trouble to come here, and now you're saying we can't get in? But I want to see Cease's new stuff. That's not every day. A mega, mega fa uh, famous fashion designer debuts new material. Mm. Yeah, everything I heard said this was some of Cece's best work. Oh. Sorry, but we only have one entry ticket remaining. Mm. One ticket. So you're saying one person could go? Mm. Hey, come on now. We can't let just one of us get a head start. Sure, I know that. It was a joke. Ah. Oh well. Maybe if we come back later, they'll have room. Ah. Yeah. It's not like this is the only clothing place. What do you say we kill some time at the dye shop? Ah. Oh. Or we could check out the pasture. Speaking of which, I've heard that a little ways up the road from the pasture is a laboratory specializing in ancient stuff. Ah. Since we got all dulled up, we might we may as well hit the town and see it all. Ah. Uh. Thank goodness they gave up, hmm? Ah. Uh. Oh my. I'm sorry to keep you waiting. Are you also a tourist who's come to see my sister? I mean, the new line of CC products? Oh. As long as it's just you, you're free to go into the shop. CC herself is in there right now, in fact. Nothing you'll see... Or nothing you'll see is for sale. It's only exhibit right now. Sorry to disappoint. Another practically perfect masterpiece. It's an exemplar of the form from every angle. This is the sort of thing on which I've built my name and reputation as the world renowned CC. Hmm? Oh, pardon me. Are you an admirer here to meet the incomparable CC? Hmm. I must say, you don't seem to show any sort of interest in fashion. Ooh. Welcome to the Ventes clothing, the only boutique in the world which carries the CC brand. And if you weren't aware no. you stand before the very woman who changed this fusty old village into the birthplace of of fashion I, I don't know how to pronounce that word as proof I present to you this no. the CC hat the newest and most magnificent work by yours truly. <laughs> this piece is so special that I dared not assign a price of it. It's not for sale. I shall only part with it 
when I find someone truly worthy of owning it. <laughs> Only the most impressive fashionista or fashionista in Hyrule's trendiest village is worth is worthy of such a crown. What's all this about Hyrule's trendiest village? I don't remember approving any any new slogans for Ateno. Uh -huh. Oh. Look who's here. What can I do for you, oh esteemed Mayor Reed? Uh... I'm really sorry. I tried to stop him from coming in like you asked, but he won't take no for an, uh, for an answer. <laughs> CC, you've got to quit littering the village with your weird art pieces. Maybe you don't realize, but plants need their sleep too. Those eyesores are so bright at night that they keep that they're keeping the veggies awake. It's a real problem for the crops. Hitano's foundation is its produce. What are we going to do if it fails? Ah. Now, now, dear. There is no need to get so worked up. I think some of the people here actually like her art, you know? Wouldn't it be better to hear her out? <coughs> Don't fall for a line of twaddle. She's got everyone in Tano Village wrapped around her finger already. My duty is to look after the village, and that's what I mean to do. Uh -huh. Looking after the village, you say? Who do you suppose... Who do you suppose you have to thank for Tano's rejuvenation? It didn't need rejuvenating. Hateno Village is a peaceful place where folks live quiet lives, and that's the way they liked it. <laughs> Do they? Then let us ha leave the matter to the people to decide. My avant-garde approach versus this bears a uh, quaint begone ways the citizens will decide which out look will drive the future of the village Aww. by holding a may a mayoral election <laughs> you're calling a mayoral election sure suits me I'll win that pretty easily Aww. Sophie I delegate management of the may may mayoral election to you what? Come on, Clevia. Or Clavia. I don't feel like sticking around here any longer. It's time we head home. There's no time to waste. Okay, let's see. Oh, you again. Ooh. I've got a long to-do list in preparation for the mayor election. And the sooner I get started, the better. No. Hmm. The answer should be should go without saying, but you of course Let's see. Let's say undecided. Oh. oh. 
If you haven't yet thrown in your lot with either Kenneth, then welcome to the team. Welcome to Team CC. Uh -huh. That sells that, I trust. It's plain for all to see that I'm a shoe in for the next mayor. No. Or so one would think, yet there are stragglers in this village still supporting Reed. They need a mental wa uh, makeover. No. And so, I have a fabulous plan to give Reed, or give out mushrooms to Reed's supporters. Ooh. Mush mushrooms are s cinemas for, or with the CC brand. Fungal fashion is the CC way. The mushrooms I give them will paint them outside and out with fresh, vibrant CC brand colors. Oh. Although, Sophie and I must mind the shop. Where will I find someone we can trust uh, to carry out this vital task? I'll do it. No. There's the magic words I was waiting for. Your lifesaver. Now then, you'll need these. Uh -huh. These mushrooms are for the villagers or villages reed supporters. It's easy to recognize them by how unstylish they are. My supporters are all expert fashionist fashionados dressed to the was it nines in Cersei? Or Cece? Uh. This should go without saying, but don't give one to any in Reed's family. No. Also, there's also no need to give them to children. Or any traveler or any temporary resident like the Sheikah researchers. That leaves us with Unless I miss my guess, a total of eight Reed supporters. No. Your mission is simple. Give a single Hylian Shroom to each of those eight misguided voters. Well, off you go. Alright, so I guess we're setting up an election. Okay. Um, with that, though, I think I'm going to go ahead and end it here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Truly really appreciate it. If you guys can, please leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, all the good stuff. If you guys want to follow us on social media, links are in the description down below. As well as check out our daily content and the weekly podcast. With that being said, this is Rob Novacast signing off. Have a good one, take care, and I will see you guys next video.